celebrity anyway. I don't think my music will ever get good enough. I am probably the only person who will ever like oatmeal breakfast. I want to keep getting better at making music. And one day, who knows I might actually make a good song. Since after three years of making songs I know I can make songs. But, I don't know if I can make songs that people will listen to. I can't remember exactly I thought three years ago. I must have been scared to make songs and put them on the internet. I did not have to worry. Since after three years very few people have listened to my songs. I have made about 150 plus songs in three years. Since about August 2016 I don't want to give up making songs even though my songs are not popular. I want to keep making songs. It's so fun. And years from now if I don't misplace my songs I will have music to listen to. Instead of listening to other people's music I will be able to listen to my own music. Years from now I will also be able to watch videos of myself playing Sudoku, instead of just watching other people play Sudoku. So I can be happy that I made things. But, will I ever make things that people like to listen to, and watch? I am not so sure about that. All I can do is try. All I can do is get better. All I can do is make things, put them out there, and see what happens. If I never try nothing will ever happen. And I might always wonder what if. Now I don't have to say what if. I can say I did that. I am sure I am repeating myself on all this. Oh, well. I need to fill up some space. The words are pouring out of me like a faucet. I wish I would let the words go down the drain, instead of writing them down when I don't write I miss writing. There is not a day that goes by that I don't write. I don't know that all this writing has made me a better writer. I am not sure if this was in a movie, or where it was but, someone said they liked a writer because he wrote like he talked. So maybe that is all I need to do. Write like I talk. Put down the words as if I were talking to you right now. I am sure years ago, if you told me that I would write every day, or write songs, or write anything at all I would have said no way. That was the way I was back then. I never thought I could do much of anything. No, I think that sounds interesting, why not give it a try? And see what happens. You never know, you may find that you are neat at something that you never know you were. What else can I ramble on about, I wonder, if I could write for 24 hours straight like I mentioned yesterday. I wonder as I mentioned yesterday what is the world record for most words written by a person in their lifetime. And do those words have to be published in a book, magazine, newspaper to count towards the record? Some people dream of climbing Everest. I want to write, write. I want to share my thoughts no words. I enjoy writing a lot more than I enjoy reading. I suppose it's because writing allows me to express myself. As I have said in a past episode I used to think that it would be great to read all day and night. Now I don't think that. There are a lot of things that you can't learn from a book. And there are a lot of things to do in the world besides sitting in front of a book or computer reading. I do enjoy reading though. It's that there is more to life than reading. What else can I talk about? I have no idea why I never thought of taking a piece of wood and some bricks or more wood 
I'm making a ramp to jump my tummy ear hornet, or Traxxas hawk off. That would have been so fun. Oh, well now I know that I can make a simple ramp. So I can try it the next time I drive a radio control car. I probably won't want to make the jump to high. If I did my radio control car might break and it's off to the store to buy a new one, or get replacement parts. I used to shoot hoops a lot when I was younger. That is so fun. Sure it's not playing against anyone. It is exercise though. And it is fun. I could have worked on my free throwing. It always amazes me when pro basketball players can't make free throws. They can make incredible shots while moving but they have trouble making half of their free throws. Or 75% of their free throws. Shooting a basketball at a basket was so fun. I have not done it in years. Maybe I will start again in 2020. And I could work on my dribbling through the legs, and other fun things. I will never be a pro basketball player but, that does not mean I can't enjoy playing basketball. Wow, I still have more room to write. I can't believe it. I wonder how many words I have written already. I wonder if it's a thousand words. I want to do so many things in life that maybe I can only do one group of things one day, and another group of things the next day. When I shoot a basketball I like to go for the three ball. You know the three point shot. I remember seeing on a show that a man in his 60s was a free throw champion. Something like that. I have never practiced free throws much. I need to start. And it might be fun to juggle basketball if I can do that. I would have to do that outside of course. I would have to imagine juggling basketballs indoors. I would break everything I am sure. Not on purpose of course. I always want to learn different juggling patterns, and I want to come up with my own juggling pattern someday. Another thing that I am doing now that I never thought I could do is juggling. It's so fun. If you want to give juggling a try. I like juggling because it gives me exercise. And I don't have to move around a lot but, I am still moving around. I don't have to run a marathon to get exercise. It's just as good as jumping rope. W is jumping rope I don't have to travel far either. Years ago I never thought I could jump rope and now I can jump rope. I have almost go enough words. I was able to solve this Sudoku puzzle in 19 minutes 13 seconds. I did not think I would get it solved. I hope to see you here tomorrow. Same place different time. I hope you have a wonderful evening. And as I said I hope to see you here tomorrow. Have a great night. Good night.